Welcome back to Bizarre Repairs. I got a special video for you guys today. I'm going to show you how to clone your work badge using a Raspberry Pi and a Proxmark 3 knockoff from eBay. Stay tuned. All right, so first things first, you want to get yourself a Raspberry Pi with Kali Linux installed, Proxmark 3 from eBay, knockoff, 75 bucks, uh, a badge that you know that works, and then we're going to be using one of these sample badges to actually write the code. Okay, so first thing you want to do is go ahead and boot up the Raspberry Pi. Um, you can connect the Proxmark if you want, but there's a couple things we need to install first, and then we'll go ahead and connect the Raspberry Pi using just a USB cable, and then get your badges ready. Stay tuned. Okay, so now we are ready to go. So make sure you have your Raspberry Pi with Kali Linux installed and uh, make sure it's updated. Then let's just go right over to GitHub and type in Proxmark 3 for Kali Linux. So this first one here, under preparing Proxmark 3 software, you'll just copy this, all of it. Okay. And you paste that right here. Hit enter. Now I already have this installed. So it's probably just going to tell me that I already have it, which I do. So next, you just want to go ahead and get clone, get the repository. Same thing, I already have this, but copy it. Paste it right here. And then just go ahead and hit enter. I already have this installed, so I'm not going to do that command. And then right when you're done with that, you'll just go into CD Proxmark 3, which is just like so. So just type in CD Smart 3. And then once you're in there, you'll just do make clean and make all, just like so. Same thing, I've already done it, but I'm just going to paste it just to show you what it looks like, just like that. Once you do that, you're pretty much done with installing it, and then you go ahead and plug in the Proxmark. Then you'll want to upgrade the Proxmark 3 to the CDC bootloader. I actually didn't have to do that, so I skipped that part. I did upgrade the Proxmark 3 firmware, which is uh, just use this uh, these lines right there. Once that was done, you can go ahead and access it. You can probably still access it without even upgrading the firmware, but you probably do want to have it at its latest version. So to access it, CD Prox Mark 3. CD Client. Okay, so now we're in it. Now you just want to run this command here. Hit enter. And that's exactly what it should look like here. Okay, so everything's installed. So now, you're gonna to wanna to place your badge. This is my work badge here. Remember to get permission if you're gonna do this. I talked to security, uh, I work in IT, so they allowed me to try this, which I'm gonna actually try it at work tomorrow. But, so I placed my badge on the Proxmark 3. I'll show a clip of it uh, in a minute. Just all right, so now go ahead and place your RF card right on the Proxima 3 like so. And now we're going to run a command to search for it. All right, so you have low frequency and high frequency commands. This is an older badge, I think an older system that it belongs to. So I'm going to try the LF search command first to see if we can find anything there. All right, and look at that tag is found. So all we need is this number that is right there, the 2322 number, and we'll be able to write our command. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is just go ahead and copy this prox tag ID. And then just write this command here, which is LF HID clone. And then go ahead and paste this here right next to it. And before you clone, go ahead and place your new card. Take your old card off and place the new card that you're going to be writing to right in the same spot. Then you're going to go ahead and press enter. Now, I don't have that card ready, but that's what you'll get when you press enter. It will say done. 
and then you can go ahead and run another LF search command and see if the card pops up and it should have the same number as it does here. So if these two numbers are identical, so you know you are good to go. Go ahead and use your card and see how it works. Thank you guys. Please like, comment, subscribe. See you on the next one. Bye-bye.